Hey guys, so I haven't posted in a while, so I wanted to jump on and do like a little small shop type post, and I'll put links if I can figure out how to in the description of my video. So, a few things that I've gotten recently is this tray. It, I, I broke it a little bit, but uh, they're sitting a replacement. Um, it says R.I.P. Tra tray. It's from Firefly Dumb Painting. Um, you can find them on Facebook. And it, it is a super nice tray. And the stopper is a slide out stopper. Which I absolutely love. And then I got this really cute little putty holder from a girl named Carissa. She is also on Facebook. And I'll try to put a link for her thing. She sent me this little pen stand as a free gift. I thought it was really cute and I love it as well as this little funnel that I thought was really cute. Um, I got some putties from um, Puttyella, I think is the name of the shop. Uh, Puttyella Mud. I got some from a D stash and some straight from her shop. This one is Vampire Blood, uh, Red Sands and Cashmere. Moonlit Graveyard, Sweet Whiskey, uh, Love and Fall most of all, and then Dragon's Blood, and these all smell amazing, absolutely amazing, and I love that I have the little putty holder to put them into, because the little putty holder, oops, the little putty holder can hold two to three putties in each slot. I've been putting three if I have three from the same company and then two if I have two from the same company. I've showed these before but I will be getting more putty from um, Patsy Putty here soon but I did place a order with Patsy Putty recently for a few little cover minders and I got a little ghost with a hatchet, a little ghost with a record player and this was a free one. It's a little bat. I also got this little cover minder, his legs move and his body moves from um, Carissa as well. I thought everything was super cute and I love everything that I got recently. I have more stuff coming in the mail and I'll continue to do small shop hauls. I also really need to do an update on my stash because I've gotten quite a few more paintings as you can see. I have another one coming in the mail, and I'm working on one of my newer ones right now. Uh, it's kind of hard to see because of how big it is, and it's rolled up there so you can't even see the top of it, but it's Solstice from Diamond Art Club by Christopher Lavelle. It's a very gorgeous piece, and you can see the colors are very bright and vibrant, and it just gets more bright and vibrant as you go this is just mostly background in her dress which is more blue than anything <coughs> oh it's not even a dress because she's wearing i don't even think she's wearing anything i'm pretty sure that she is uh fully nude but she has a piece of fabric in her hand as you can see and the fabric is blue it's a beautiful painting though and i'm very excited to be working on this one i'm about to work on this little section here. I've been taking my sections and cutting them up into three as I work. I also got some new washi tapes like this one that's here. Um, I'm going to go through and do a whole new washi tape collection and show all my washi tapes soon because I keep upgrading and getting more and more and more. Um, but I buy them. Most of my washi tapes are from Diamond Art Club and most of them even the ones that are not I've gotten from a D stash group so I'm just going to do a full show of all of them at once instead of doing individual videos for the um, putty or from the um, washies that I've gotten from D stash groups. Um, but you can look forward to seeing a video coming out that's going to have items from Patsy Putty, just more putty. Um, I also ordered a putty from Butterfly Effectwares. And I will show that in a video as well as I got putties from a D stash group. I don't remember the name of the person who made the putties, but I'll also show those. And then, um, oh, super excited. The painting that I'm getting um, in my 
in the mail, I'll get it on Friday. It is a mystery painting, which will be my first mystery painting from Ines Guerrero, as well as I got it from Emeralds and Fairy Lights from a D-Stash. So I'm super excited to be getting a painting that's from a YouTuber that I absolutely love and adore. She's one of the YouTubers that got me into watching um, Diamond Painting YouTube as well as wanting to start my own channel. So I'm really, really excited to be getting a diamond painting from her stash. Um, but yeah, I think that's all the new stuff that I got. I don't think I've gotten any new pins or anything like that lately. Just that stuff, and then I've gotten, like I said, some new diamond paintings, which I guess I can go ahead and show the new paintings. Um, I got apples from Christopher Lavelle. So I've been wanting this one for a while. It's absolutely beautiful. You guys have already seen these two. It's that's, those are just Siamese teas and um, the world I used to know. I recently got Magic Portals by Ines Guerrero. Absolutely stunning piece. Love it. I got this one by Ines Guerrero. Um, Lunum Pathasium, I think is how you say it. Beautiful piece. I think I've already showed Forest Creep, Forest Keeper and Artemisa, Lady of the Lake. I think I've already shown all of these. The Wicked Witch is the last one down there by Ines Guerrero. And I'm pretty sure I showed all of those in a um, prior video. But that's the update on my stash stuff so far. And I'll show you guys um, the, well, I won't show you the mystery painting because I don't want to spoil it. But it is a mystery painting. I'll share what number it is for people who want to know what number it is. But I probably won't ever post it just because I don't want to be one of those people that spoils things. Um, I'm hoping to be getting a ring light set up so I can do whipping chats at some point soon. Uh, that's a goal of mine. Hopefully, hopefully that'll be happening relatively soon. Um, oh, another thing I will be getting soon will be my Christmas tray that I ordered from Firefly um, Diamond Painting as well. So hopefully that'll be um, really soon. Oh, and I don't think I showed you the bottom of this one. It says Halloween 2023. This is where I broke it, was the tray, the lid track. I was rubbing it down with um, a fabric softener, or not a fabric softener, I'm so sorry, a dryer sheet to reduce the static because the, the painting, I had started apples and the, di the diamonds were really, really sticky. They also smelled really, really bad. Um, that's why I'm not working on apples right now and I switched to solstice. But while I was rubbing down my tray, I somehow accidentally made this come loose um, but I posted in the group and they reached out to me and they said that in a couple of weeks I'll have a brand new one and they're so sorry that this happened so I'm very grateful for to them that's wonderful customer service that's better customer service than I could ever imagine since this was my fault it was something I did it wasn't something that was wrong with the uh, tray itself to begin with so that's just amazing that they were willing to do that. I didn't even ask. I was just posting to be like, I'm so heartbroken that this happened to me. And they were so nice to offer to send me a new one. So I'm very, very grateful to them. And I will also, like I said, be showing the uh, Christmas one that I ordered as soon as it gets here. I'm hoping to, that it'll arrive in a few days. Because I ordered it about a week and a half to two weeks ago now. So hopefully that'll be here soon. Hey guys, thank you. And have a good day.